Now with the nudge in the track of the storm a little bit farther to the west, it gives confidence to the National Hurricane Center to issue a hurricane warning now for Suffolk County, Long Island. It's a tropical storm warning for Nassau County, coastal Westchester, coastal Fairfield County, Connecticut. A warning basically means not only are hurricane conditions a possibility, they are expected within 36 hours in the warned area. So Suffolk County, Long Island under that warning. And now the five bars of New York City are under a tropical storm watch, even into interior areas in northeastern New Jersey. There's a storm surge warning in effect for much of eastern Long Island. A storm surge watch just off to the west. We get that high tide cycle during the day on Sunday. We're very concerned about, especially since we have the full moon causing tides to already be higher than normal. 70 mile per hour tropical storm right now on the cusp of hurricane strength, likely to strengthen to a hurricane over the warm Gulf Stream waters over the next 12 to 18 hours. And then look at the track of this. You don't see this too often. Initially, it's going off to the north, and then it gets drawn back in toward the coastline. And the National Hurricane Center now explicitly showing a landfall over eastern Long Island during the day Sunday, midday into the early afternoon hours as a hurricane. Rough surf and rip currents developing as early as tomorrow. The outer rain bands impacting the coast later on tomorrow night. But the brunt of the storm is Sunday, the worst of the wind and rain over Long Island. We have all the details. Parts of the area could get wind gusts up to 100 miles per hour on Sunday. It's a triple threat, wind, rain, and coastal flooding and storm surge.